Osin Bajo's panel recommends Babachur, Oksak to Buhari. The suspended secretary to the government of the Federation, SGF, Babachur David Lowell and the director general of the National Intelligence Agency, Naya Aok, may have lost their jobs. The presidential panel that investigated the duo recommended that they should be replaced. The panel was headed by acting president, Professor Yemi Osin Bejo. A report by Daily Trust indicates that the suspended SGF, Babacher David Lowell and the DG of Naya Aok have been relieved of their duties. According to the report, the presidential panel set up to investigate the activities of the duo recommended that they should be disengaged and replaced. Others members of the investigation panel are, the National Security Advisor, General Babagana Monguno, RTD, and the Attorney General of the Federation, Abu Bakar Malami. Acting President Professor Yemi Osinbajo's panel had said there won't be soft landing for Baba Cherlewal and Aook. <laughs> President Muhammadu Buhari had on April 19, suspended Baba Chur and Oak and set up the committee to come up with a resolution within a period of two weeks. Babacher was investigated for allegedly awarding millions of Naira contracts to a company in which he had interest, Global Vision Limited, under the presidential initiative on the Northeast, Fine. Oak was probed for alleged $43.4 million operations cash found by the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission at Apartment 7B in Osborne Towers, Ikoyi, Lagos. A senior government official, quoted in the report, said the investigations indicted both officials. The report of the investigations is ready. The two suspended officials were recommended for total disengagement and replacement. It is clearly stated in the report that they should not be brought back to their positions. They are to be disengaged as recommended. As promised, the committee gave fair hearing to all the parties involved. It was a thorough investigation. You would recall that the investigation was slightly extended beyond the two-week period which Mr. President gave the committee, the source stated. In a statement issued on May 3, the spokesman to the acting president, Leolu Akant had said that the panel was scheduled to submit its report to President Buhari on Monday. May 8. But President Buhari left Nigeria for the United Kingdom on May 7 for a follow-up consultation with his doctors. The source also disclosed that during their appearances before the panel, Babacher and Oak made some revelations that would lead to the investigation of some other top government officials. Baba Cherlewa was said to have indicted some senior government officials. Photo credit, The Guardian. The source, however, refused to mention names of those officials, he merely said that some of them currently occupy key positions in government. Three months ago, Nage. Com reported that the panel vowed that there will be no soft landing for Baba Chur and Oak. <laughs>